Good morning, everyone. It's about 5.45, and I know it's crazy out there right now. Like, there's all this stuff going on in the world, but there is so much to be thankful for, and I don't understand why people are not talking about it. I mean, we live in such a great country, you know, and, and, and I get it. There's a lot of things going on right now, but when we look at the simple things, like little things in life, like getting outside and enjoying Mother Nature, in, in the summertime or it's it's you know, late spring early summer here in Michigan but it's just it, it's so awesome and, it, and if you if you bring positive vibes to the table you're going to get positive vibes back so I know it's only 5 45 in the morning and I'm all jacked up but yesterday I was in Manistee salmon fishing now I'm headed up to Saginaw Bay to do some walleye fishing tomorrow I'm probably gonna do some bass fishing locally around the house it's just I make it a priority for me to get out and enjoy the things that I love to do this time of year. So forget all the craziness going on out there and just get outside and, you know, breathe in Mother Nature. It's such an awesome time to be alive. I'm not trying to blind myself. I get it. There's a lot of craziness going on out there. But again, you, you got to get back to your roots and, you know, say what you want to say about country people. But, you know, I just, I, I'm so thankful that to be able to do what I do. And I really appreciate everybody's support. So let's get on the water. Probably about another hour and a half we'll be on the water. And yeah, let's see if we can get, catch some walleye. So stay tuned. One more thing before we get on the water. So I was just thinking about this. And it's always awkward trying to end these videos. You know, at the very end, it's always kind of like, how do, you, how do you end these videos? And I think I finally figured out the way I'm going to end my there was a speaker that I got to uh, listen to their presentation. I think it was probably two years ago. And a, a little bit, work was a little bit rough. I was putting a lot of pressure on myself. I didn't have a good attitude every day. I, I wasn't, you know, thankful for what I had. I wasn't enjoying life. And this speaker made a statement that has stuck with me. And I am forever thankful that I sat in on this presentation. And... I kind of live by this at work now, so I'm going to live by this on my channel. So I'm going to try to remember every time I sign off to say this thing. But if you guys can remember this, showing gratitude changes your attitude. Let me say that again. Showing gratitude changes your attitude. So whenever you're feeling down in the dumps, whenever you think it's rough, call a friend or family member. Tell them you love them. Tell them you appreciate them. And it is amazing how quickly your attitude will change. Um, you know, I just I just made this first part of this video, and I told you guys how thankful I was for having everybody support. And it kind of just like gave me this this chill, like, man, I I'm very very thankful for everything that you guys do and all the support you give me. So, again, changing your attitude is as easy by show, as easy as possible by showing gratitude. So that's gonna be my new sign offs. But yeah, we've got a lot of fishing coming ahead. So uh, stay tuned. Is that a good one? Yeah. All right, first fish of the day we think is hooked up. So we got it on a bandit, one of the church boards. Right shoulder, Brandon. There's a head shake we like. Decent fish. It's a good fish. Oh yeah. That's a nice one. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, that first one's 200 back, so. Hold it.
There it is. There we go. Purple. Sure. Purple. Purple. Nice of purple. Here we go. Purple it is. Boat flip. Oh yeah. Purple. 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 Pull them up for the camera when you get a chance. There you go. Number four. Number three. Number three. Oh, that's that. Uh, you know what? That's this color right here. Um, this one. Purple there? No. The that hologram? One. Yeah, the hologram one. I just put it out. Why are you doing it? Hologram put a good black dot on that baby, too. Still there? Uh, it's pulling back, but it ain't very heavy, too. If it is. There it pulled, pulled that time, didn't they see that? Right there. Right over your right left shoulder. shoulder. See it? Okay. Nice, bud. Easy, girl. Easy, girl. Fish comes together. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed it. That was on camera. <laughs> that was on camera. <laughs> Rookie. Oh. Rookie mistake. Oh, no. That's a decent fish, too, wasn't it? Yeah. It's long. I got nervous. No, he's. <laughs> So quick midday update, it is, what time is it? 12? 12.05. .05. And we're in about what, 11 feet of water? 10, 11 feet of water. Flicker shads are the trick. We've got five now. So yeah, a little bit late to get onto a pattern, but I guess better late than never. Taking the board back pretty good. Yeah, there's a weed on it though. I hope that's not what I'm reeling in. No, he, he was taking it back. I felt the weed come out. Of here. It's that holographic one again. Sunny days, I like that hologram. Are we filming? Yeah, of <laughs> course we're, we're always filming, man. Never stop right. filming. Laying down nicely. Yeah, I was dumping the board. I got color. Nice fish. Nice fish. Nice fish. Nice fish. There we go. Nice fish. There we go. That's, That's what we're looking for. I thought that was a congratulatory fish. It was. Woo! It kind of was. Yeah. It kind of was. Sure, you hold them up for the camera when you get a chance. Let me just pull this hook out of the net. So it wasn't hologram, that was that purple green. That was purple? Or, that was a 100 foot. That's a nice fish. Let's fish the bait right there. Close. Here we go. 
be down there. Yeah. You know there's a little magnet on that, Jay? Yeah. I'll trust you. Got some fight going. Wrong species. Yeah. Off the old stern planer board from church. That's right. Church boards for life. Like them flicker shads. Hold them up for the can. Well, it took us a little bit to uh, put together a pattern, but we did finally end up catching some fish in about probably 10 to 13 foot of water. And uh, flicker shads was was it. I mean, we had uh, we were running bandits, running a little bit deeper water, and uh, just just wasn't happening. But um, yeah, flicker shads with the lure lipstick gel formula that was the ticket. Uh, purple, and then uh, I think it was the holographic or hologram, whatever you want to call it flicker shad um, yeah it was it was pretty hot and heavy there for a while but we ended up with eight fish uh, biggest two were probably 22 maybe 23 inches um, you know maybe good good four pounds uh, four and a half pounds so yeah all in all it was a pretty good day she got really hot wind died down which it wasn't supposed to the wind was actually supposed to pick up so that's always interesting but yeah definitely appreciate you guys watching this video and uh, if you haven't already please please subscribe to Blue Jays Outdoors uh, be sure to follow me on Instagram at uh, blue underscore J underscore maple underscore syrup. And really appreciate you guys watching again, like I said. And remember, uh, showing gratitude will change your attitude. So catch you next time.